basically I was interested by a concept of ivory tower. And this is, I think, a natural children instinct. They you know make building and, and run under on the table. And this was a continuation of that how I perceive it now. It's a basic instinct. You want to hide yourself to have a shelter. And this is an intellectual shelter. This is true for any many for a huge number of mathematicians. For many, many they want to hide in, in this tower. If you look at evolution theory or Darwinism, whatever, it's 99% mathematics and 1% even less of biology. Right? And this, the fact is we have exponential function, it grows like hell. If you cut it, something happens. And that's about, about it. And it's an amazingly powerful thing in biology, which biologists are open their mouths when they, they actually understood it. The lesson you can learn for, from different sciences, which mathematics, inside of mathematics you can receive. In mathematics you only can have an urge, everything to make mathematical. But how to do that is another story. Mathematics don't help you. On the contrary, it may deceive you because people say, oh, yeah, I have this kind of theory, let's apply it to both. It's such nonsense, it never works. You have to do everything anew. You try, of course, to be conservative. And when you fail, you succeed. But you fail too much, you fail. Like evolution, yeah? The only way nature knows, don't change anything. Actually, now they found some counterexample. Recently, they found bacteria which purposefully make mutations. But for the most part of that, all nature knows, don't change. However, something hits, you change. And you go to hell. But sometimes, it changes in a good direction. And the same education, it keeps you unchanged and sometimes you change and that's great. You have to have idea what to observe. If you don't know what you want to see, you see nothing. Again, citing Claude Bernard, he was one of the brightest you know, heads of the 19th century, in France at least. And um, so you have to observe and you have to think, you have to think, you have to observe, it's difficult, yeah. But observe, not only just observe, you have to really focus. Like in biology, you don't look at the, on, 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 on somebody's hands and whatever you create technical means and intellectual means to see something. Even if you take all this machinery you have in biology, if you don't know what to see, you see nothing. He blobs, that's it. You already have to have a pretty good idea what is inside, and then you need to see it.